The Asia Internet Coalition, AIC, a regional ICT policy group, has voiced concerns about the government's plan for data localization, suggesting it could do more harm than good. The AIC presented its report, Data Localization in Pakistan, at a roundtable on data production and the digital economy held at the Ministry of IT and Telecommunications on Thursday. The meeting included representatives from AIC, Google, and Meta. Although the ministry's statement after the meeting did mention the report, it did note that the discussions were held on data localization, with participants providing recommendations on data hosting and sensitivity. Minister of State for IT and Telecommunication Shaza Fatma Khwaja emphasized that data regulation and cybersecurity are top priorities for the current government. She also expressed commitment to achieving the $25 billion IT export target, stating that the private sector is being fully supportive to transform Pakistan into a digital economy. However, the AIC report was less than optimistic about the government's plan to require IT companies to have local data centers. The report warned that this move could lower productivity, increase business costs for IT companies, Companies and lead to unemployment. Rohan Samarjeeva, the report's author, explained that data localization could seriously impact the industry as local companies can't compete with global giants like Google and Amazon. The report estimated that data localization could reduce labor productivity by 4.7% by 2025 and result in a potential loss of 3.2 million jobs and $16.5 billion in GDP. The report also highlighted a skills gap in Pakistan, noting that there aren't enough skilled workers to manage data centers effectively. It mentioned concerns about cybersecurity, warning that centralizing all key public and private data in one location could make it a prime target for hackers. Pakistan's IT infrastructure has shown vulnerabilities to cyber attacks in the past, with key organizations like Nadra and the FBR being targeted, compromising the data of millions of citizens. That's the latest update on Pakistan's data localization debate.